I'm Johnny Gershoni, a professor of uh, immunology and virology here at Tel Aviv University, Faculty of Life Sciences, and I've been studying the interactions between viruses that cause human disease and our immune response for many, many years. And since then, we've been working now, it's over 15 years, on coronaviruses, first with SARS coronavirus 1, and then subsequently in 2012, there was the emergence of MERS coronavirus, and we've been working on MERS now for well over six years. By studying both of these viruses, it became clear that there are some common structures in the spike protein of coronaviruses that interact with their corresponding receptors. And because of the similarities and differences, we realized that we can propose a model that could be used for the development of coronavirus vaccines. With the emergence of the COVID-19 epidemic and SARS coronavirus 2, we found ourselves well prepared with the specific objective in trying to devise targeted and possibly more focused and safer vaccines for coronaviruses. The 3M grant is a true lifesaver, as far as I can say. It provides us with the funds needed in order to work on developing the vaccine, and hopefully together, 3M and ourselves, will be able to come out and say, yes, we've contributed something in trying to curb and deal with this current pandemic. During the COVID-19 pandemic, it's important that 3M holds true to its core values by supporting our communities and improving lives. Science is at the heart of our company, and we are dedicated to advancing the rapid study of the virus, particularly through research projects focused on treatments and vaccine development. The research grant to Professor Gershoni's team at Tel Aviv University is one of a series of grants totaling $5 million that 3M has made to leading education establishments around the world. Professor Gershoni is a well-known expert in viral pathogen, and I am delighted that 3M has chosen to support his ongoing vaccine research here in Israel. We hope that this project is the start of future collaborations between 3M and the university, and we will be watching the progress and outcome of Professor Gershoni's research with great interest.